Hey you guys, hey you guys, it's your girl Kayla B. You know me and it's the end of the month. This is a very short month. It's a very important month, but it's a very short month. So I had to put a lot of videos in one month. Also, I'm just getting over a cold and I was out of commission for a couple days. So this week, as you saw, it's been like a video every single day or sometimes two videos in one day. It's like, it's, it's been crazy. It's been crazy, but it's the end of the month, and um, <clears throat> you already know what it means. It's get ready with me with Shop My Stash products. Yes, every single time in the beginning of the month on a Sunday, I do Shop My Stash where I show a bunch of products that I picked out from my stash that I'm going to be using through the month and the products that I don't really use that much or I used but I didn't use as much as I used the other products. Um, basically, I don't really use that much of the stuff that I picked from my Shop My Stash. I use it. I use it and I play with it and we just talk in the comments and we just have a fun time. That's basically what it is. It's just like a get ready with me. Sometimes I do a specific look, sometimes I don't. That's just what it is. And we do it every single month on a Sunday. And at the end of the month is actually a Sunday. So, it is shop my stash, makeup look. Get ready with me mm. with Shop My Stash uh. products. Pop, 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 products. Pop, 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 products. Yo, my skin looks like I'm baby smooth. Like my skin looks like a baby's bottom. Wow. And then I got my hair like up in this hat. I'm gonna do a full review in a different video. It's probably gonna be before this video. But, ooh. You wanna see, you wanna see, you wanna see, oh, you wanna, you wanna, you wanna see. Uh. Anyways, let's start with the eyes. I just did eyebrows, eyebrows, I used the Morphe brow pencil. That was one of my brow pencils that I was using and building, but yeah, they, they came out nice. I like that brow pencil. It's not my favorite, but it doesn't beat the Maybelline, but it's a good brow pencil, you know? I took out some of my brow hairs on my bad eyebrows side but you know that's when it gets to the end though so it's all right so for the palette today i'm going to be using is the huda b rose gold remastered i have been using this i've been loving this i always love this ever since i first got it i've always used it but i have so many palettes that it doesn't get loved as much as my other palettes it's just so beautiful you could tell that I've used it. Like you could tell with the dents and the powders. Like you could tell that I've used it and abused it. But it just, I haven't gotten a dent. I haven't gotten a dent, oh my gosh. But it's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. And I might use it today. Oh, what should I, I should do a neutral look, right? I shouldn't do a pink look. I did a pink look with this and I did like a smoky, um, rosy eye for one of my videos for Valentine's Day. I did like a whole bunch of just looks already with this palette, but I guess I'm gonna go neutral. I I always go either smoky, neutral, or rosy. It's just, that's 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 what they give you, okay? This with this smoky, all right, and then these shades right here, rosy. Okay, and then these shades right here, neutral, with a pop of gold. It's just in, in a corner or, you know, in the middle. It, it gets you neutral. And then these shades right here are my favorite shades for highlight. Like, those shades for highlights, oh my gosh. Bless, Moon Dust, and Bubbly. Mix them together for a highlight. If you have this palette and you're gonna see, every time someone asks me for my highlight, I'm like, oh, it's eyeshadow. Isn't that like a highlight that you could buy? They're like, what, what eyeshadow? I'm like, oh, from the Huda Beauty um, Rose Gold Remastered palette? They was like, yeah, oh, shade. I was like, I have mixed the three shades by the matte shades. Um, I know one of them is Moon Dust. I mix one, I put all three together, and then I put it on my face. They was like, oh, okay. Yeah, so, um, I mean, you could put, if you're a deep like me, those three, 
If you're lighter, I would suggest Moon Dust and Bubbly. If you're lighter than that, then Moon Dust. Um, and if you're lighter than all of that, um, then um, don't use any of them for highlights. Just letting you know. <laughs> um, anyways, let's just get into this palette. I'm going to go in with my Farrah blending brush. And I'm just going to go in with some sandalwood. I love that shade to start off. Especially when I do a neutral eye. Oh, that's the, like the perfect like brow bone matte pop shade. It just goes everywhere when I throw my brush. And then I tap. And then, oh, I love her powder, like her big pan because there's no messing up with the formula. Like they're all pigmented. They don't like they blend easily. They are not splotchy. There's like there's no inconsistencies in the shadows. Everything just work so well together. Like that's why I love her big palettes. But her big palettes like 65, 67, sometimes 68 dollars. So it's like why? Why so much? Why can't you be like 45, 48 like all the other, other brands? You want to be bigger. I understand. Because you know Natasha, Nona, and Pat McGrath, they have great formulas. And theirs is like 100 and something dollars. And their smaller piles are like 60 something dollars. Um, or, or, or Pat McGrath is like 90 something dollars. So I understand why you do it. It's just, um, <laughs> okay. I'm gonna go into some suede. It's like a gray shade. I'm just gonna see how that looks, if it looks any type of different. Just taking it in the inner corner and up. Yeah, it has like a little dimension. All right, so then I'm gonna go in with a little bit of henna. That um, orangey brown right there. And I'm just gonna take that more in the middle well that's pretty i actually would put that all over the lid and just put a wing and call it a day um but that's how i feel oh that's pretty i kind of just want to put that all over the lid wait let's not um, yeah, let's not, um, do a wing, but let's smoke it out a little bit with that black. Ooh, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take, um, black truffle. I'm gonna take it on a different brush. Here's my favorite brush. This is the 321 Morphe brush. Yes, M321. I know my favorite brush. This is my favorite, like, detailed brush. Especially, like, when I'm blending something. It just, like, diffuses it so perfectly. And it places the stuff so perfectly. Ugh. I love it. Since I just like to drag it because I like to drag it like this. Like I would do if I would do like just like create that shape before I blend it. Like do that and do that a little bit. To the eye before I blend it. Oh that is perfect. <clears throat> You're like, Kayla, it's not blended yet. Yeah, I know it's not blended. Give me a minute. Oh, that henna shade is so beautiful. I am so happy that I put that on the eye. And now, blended. Blended. It's mixed with that henna shade. And you put that... Henna on the eye, and then you blend. See? See how it turns grayish, 
black so you still get that smoky effect but not that harsh smoky effect like you still get some dimension but not like too much and i love that i love i love how you can manipulate this black or you could just have it like straight up pigment it's just so beautiful so beautiful i just want to leave it like this like i just want this to be my face call it a day yes <laughs> I've really been doing neutral looks lately. I don't know. I don't know what's up with me. I, I guess because my body was like, okay, like, you're going to get sick. Chill out. Just chill. So I'm using a different highlight today. So I'm going to take the three shades that I usually do for highlight from my inner corner. And I'm just going to pop that in the inner corner. Right there, you see that? You see how beautiful that is? Do you not see how beautiful that is? Like, that's gorgeous right there. That's gorgeous. Whoo! For primer, I'm going to use the Clarins Instant Smooth um, Blurring Primer. I only used this once this um, month. I'm going to keep it a buck. I only used it once. And I needed to use it again. Um, I really don't use it that much because, first of all, it's really, really pretty. It costs a lot of money. It's Clarence. It's the Clarence Instant Smooth Perfecting Touch Primer. It's really, really pretty. It has, like, mirrored packaging with the um, fingerprints. It has, like, a little swirly moment in there. But it's like you take a little, but and a little goes a long way. But it's just, it's not that much in here. So, because it's not that much in here, I just dropped the cap from my leg. Um, you just need a little bit. I should have just put the cap right there. Um, let me take the rest and also size in the nose and that's it literally and then you just smooth it into your skin again a little goes along the way tap 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 oh that smells so good I forgot how good it smells every freaking um high-end product their like products smell so good when i say so good i mean so good Ooh. okay i definitely needed it underneath um underneath my nose the makeup it's like a little white cast with um light as you can see but when you have the foundation over you cannot tell like you cannot tell oh, and i love just patting it into my skin and letting it wait so that's what i'm gonna do when i come back i'm gonna have the born to glow foundation from nyx i only use this once another product i only used once this month I don't know what's going on. I just, I really like the other two foundations. And I was really using the Elf foundation a lot. So. Oh, and I still need to do a review on the Elf foundation. I, I did one. I just didn't put it up yet. It should be put up before this video. If I have time, if I have spots still left, I'll put it up before this video. And if I did do it before um, this video, that it would be linked above in the cards. I know I haven't been doing that much and linking stuff in the cards. But I'm going to do it for this video. This is the Morphe Concealer. They have a new foundation. And I think they have a new concealer. Um, this is in C545. <sighs> this concealer is like really right on me. But I'm going to make it work. I'm gonna make it work because I got a lot of stuff to do today. I gotta get my mom's medication. Gotta get my birth control. I have a date today. I'm 
There's a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, I also need to do some errands. I need to do laundry. I might be embarrassed by saying this, but I haven't done laundry in um, a good three weeks. I still have clothes, but I'm running out of underwear. So I'm like, yo, I need to do laundry like in the next four days. Because I only have four days left of underwear. It's crazy how I have more clothes than underwear. I shouldn't do that. I shouldn't. I should have as much clothes that I have. Like I should have much underwear. But I have like a lot of clothes. Like a lot, a lot. And sometimes I find stuff and I'm like, yo, I haven't seen you in like six, seven months. Where have you been? It's crazy. It's really crazy. Um, R6 from Morphe. I love that brush. That brush is like my favorite. No. No. You know what? I couldn't get it out. As you can see, I couldn't get it out. I'm just gonna do this on the day and I'm just gonna keep it right here. Every time I feel it move, I'm just gonna adjust it. There we go. That's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, I was like so happy. It's like I didn't get no eyeshadow on it. I didn't get nothing on it. Cause usually if I'm like wearing something, I'm gonna wear it out. I usually do my makeup with like my shirt that I don't have on, like off. And then I put it on like slowly over my head. Cause I don't know what makeup on it. I'm like very careful. But then I just it just like squirted out. I forgot how I forgot how that just like squirts out. Cause usually I like put this stuff on my face cause I really don't like to put it on the brush cause it like seeps like really, really into the brush and it's like really hard to come off. I mean, I do use like foundation brushes twice and then I like, like if I'm using the same like foundation twice, like in a row, which I'm probably gonna do with this, um, I use the foundation brush twice and then I just like wash it. So I was trying to like prolong the thing of this because this would just freshly, like freshly, freshly washed. I freshly washed. I was trying to prolong the time of me clean getting a new brush. Like have other brushes. Obviously, I just got two foundation brushes this month, but I haven't tried it yet. So it's like, damn. Damn, 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 damn. See, that's that's what that's what happens when I try to be cheap or try to be lazy. Um, I'm using the Marc Jacobs. Um, I'm gonna come off from the wash, but it's like this was like fresh out the dryer type thing, and I'm not gonna wash my clothes. Well, like this was like, I mean, I'm gonna wash my clothes soon. It's just in like probably like three days. But I was gonna wear this tomorrow. Like I like to wear like mix match. I was gonna wear this hoodie tomorrow. I had a plans to wear for blue jeans. No, I'm not. Um, it's a Marc Jacobs duo. As you can see, I've been using the primer a lot. Um, I've been using the powder too. When I don't use the fancy powder, I was using the Marc Jacobs powder. That powder is bomb. I should get it in full size. It was on pop up. Boxy pop up, and why did I not get it in full size? I do not know. I do not know. I regret that day. I regret that day. I'm not gonna hold you. I do. It had like a little mesh. Oh, I just got like powder. I'm wasting powder. No, and it's tiny. I don't want to waste powder. I'm taking my um Larousse powder brush. This is a big ass powder brush. <laughs> From the south. Yes, mulatto. I don't know why she's in my head. Oh, but she's in my head. She's doing things to me. She's doing things to me, y'all. I always was a mulatto fan. I mean, I was like, like, like not liking her because she was like, oh, I'm the best out of everyone. Blah, blah, blah. Didn't that boy beat her? Like, or am I like getting two? I'm probably getting two seasons mixed up. 
because she did win one season and then Nova won the other season. So it's like I'm getting two ones mixed up, but I feel like someone was better than her in, in, in that season. I gotta rewatch that season because that's the only season I saw on Netflix. So I'm like, I don't even wanna rewatch it. Ooh. 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 Powder. Set your face with powder. Set your face with powder. Set your face with powder. Don't try to waste at me. Powder. Powder, 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 don't waste no powder. Set those in the eyes, you don't want no kisses. Set those left lines. You don't want to be speechless. Oh my God. You gotta set your face and you look like a Casper ghost. Set it with some spreading spray. So you could say, Vamanos. To the ashiness. Of the powder, but you never waste powder. Never waste, never waste no powder. Tap it in, tap it in, so set and lock in before the day begins. Oh, wow, that was deep. <laughs> oh. Yes, so the base, the base is done, and wow, my eyes look really good. Like, my base is looking really, really good, and I really, really like it. Like, do you not see that? Oh, by the way, I use the Tarte Mar Maracuja Spray. I like that spray. That spray is bomb. Okay, um, for blush and highlight. Blush and highlight, usually I spray... I usually I spray after blush and highlight so it can like melt in but because of that Marc Jacobs powder even though it like locks in and it makes everything smooth and everything else has a little tint as you could saw as you saw has a tint if I use a sponge like a lot of people use a sponge to bake to put powder on their face and everything else it would just melt right in but because I don't use a sponge it's on and it shows all right but you can see how it just like highlights my face and just, it looks amazing. Okay, it looks, it looks amazing. So for blush, I'm using the Alamara Cosmetics Colorette Blue, uh, Blush Trio um, in dark, well, in deep, right? In dark rich. This is Deserted Oasis and Candela. Candela? Candela. So yeah, I'm going to use the orange. I mean, that's the that's the most I, I use. I use the orange and oasis in this palette. Like I'm looking at the palette, I'm like, yeah, I use I use the orange more than all the pal all the other ones in the palette. Um, this is Crown of My Canopy from Wet and Wild. The highlight that's what I'm gonna be using today. So Alamar with Alamar. This is their complexion brush, even though they. I think they now have complexion products. I don't know. Um, but this is their complexion product. They have um, bronzer. They have highlights. They have this. They have... Um, oh, that looks so beautiful. They have... They have um, other stuff. I'm saying other stuff. Um, they have um eyeshadow primers, eyeshadow palettes. They have lip glosses, um, lip liners. They have it all. You name it. Like besides concealer, foundation, and powder, they don't have that. 
but they have a lot of stuff so yeah and they don't have a brow product if they had a brow product they probably would buy it i'm not gonna hold you or i would wait until like it was in bossy pop-up or something but yeah oh that's just like beautiful it's like more natural for my complexion for my complexion that's the more natural um blush is that um blush right there i'm gonna wait to like put more on because i'm just gonna go over it i'm gonna go over the highlight with that blush so now i'm just gonna take some highlights and again crown of my canopy from wet and wild and i use this highlight a lot but i always like digging it in the same spot i want to see if i ever hit pan there so i use this like a lot of times but i have like a lot of highlights like i have a lot of eyeshadow palettes i have like a lot of highlights so you know you try you try and you try pretty that's pretty blended it's like this bam this blended <laughs> it's pretty blended it's like okay you're not doing too much you're doing just a right amount think that you highlighted too much you can always go over it with blush that's what I said I'm gonna go over it with blush because I don't feel like locking in my face again with setting spray because I only have one of those um my for for Sally Rose Gold Mist I bought two of those so um <laughs> I'm gonna use that before I use that okay I'm just using that because I put I put that on this month. All right, for Sally is gonna be next month. I'm just gonna let you know that by now. Um, yeah, going back to for Sally. Oh, that is so beautiful. That blush is like gorgeous, gorgeous, gor or or gorgeous. Oh, oh yes. I love my face, okay? I love my face. My face is amazing. That right there on my hoodie is not, but you know, it is what it is. We're just gonna see if we can just... You know, if we're just gonna... And so I can stay there. See if that works. Oh shit, it works. No, no. What? It worked. Okay, alright. Okay, alright. For lips, lastly, we have Mar. I was gonna say Mar Jacobs. Um, this is the MAC Cosmetics Double Fudge Lipstick. And is it matte? Matte lipstick, yes. You already know I love matte lipstick. And Laura Lee and Jaybird. I had to run real quick. I swear. Like, that just made me upset. Because I had to run. I had to run because <laughs> my camera was dying. And I was like, I just charged this. This just was like full person. That means I was talking for a long time. I was talking for like an hour or so. Mmm. Is very deep for the south. For the south, it is very deep, and because of that, it's not gonna go with the south. No. So, some Jaybird. Ugh, I love me some Jaybird. Some Jaybird. I'm actually waiting for a call. So, if you hear something in the background, it's gonna be my phone.
you see how it just like it makes like a subtle look of color that's just gorgeous mm. I'm not gonna put this straight up in there no that would be stupid Go over to this, and uh, yep, yeah, I'm not buying a new one anytime soon. No, I am not. Probably like two or three months, but not like weeks or days. Cause I used to, sh I use JBird a lot. I'm not gonna hold you. I use JBird a lot, and I use any Mac lipsticks a lot. So I'm really surprised that a Mac lip gloss I went through faster than a lipstick. And I wear MAC lipsticks more than MAC lip glasses. That's how you could tell from the MAC lip glass formula, how much time you have to apply it to cream lipsticks, the matte lipsticks. Like, you could tell the difference. Anyways, this is the end of the look. Again, just a natural little smoky succession. Like, look at that. Little smokiness, little fluff of the eyebrows not fully filled in but just like a little fluff here and there and I love that with this and then the lips it just it's perfect oh by the way for mascara I use the XXL roll dial mascara because no it's my favorite like lengthening and, and volumizing like mascara like for my natural days like hello beautiful but yeah so that's it for this video i hope you guys liked it have a great day have a great night whenever you're watching this and bye you guys also i have um stuff in the description box go check it out go check it out it's all my social medias everything also i have a tiktok channel go check it out also some of these products will be linked in the description box so if you want to check them out check it out also video right here head right here go check